Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru. It is January 30th, 2022, and I am here to talk further about Candy Royale, which is an event that some of us have in Candy Crush. I actually was going to take a break from it here since it seemed broken and play it on my phone. I can't get it on my iPhone. Don't know why. But it is here for me and it appears to be working now. If you want the background to this and how it failed me, I do have another video. If you ask for that, I will certainly give you the link. So it shows me that I've beaten now one out of five levels. If I go to the map screen, this is the level that I was able to beat and I have to beat five in a row. So they have these laurel wreaths here. Uh, indicating how far I have to get. I've got almost 24 hours. Here is the Jelly Queen. She's on the top with this pot of 100 gold bars. But remember, there are 99 other people on my team or in my group. And so they're also going to be trying to get their share of gold. So I might get 100 gold if I'm the only person to complete this in 24 hours. Or I might get one if all 100 of us are able to complete this. And so generally speaking, I would not invest boosters in order to get this done. Uh, again, I have more complete information on that other video, but I just want to show you my progress. Now, I'm probably not going to be able to get my reward uh, for the next 23 hours because we have to see the course of action that it takes for everyone else who else gets up to the top but what i'm going to do is pause the recording beat these levels real quickly and come on back to you to show you what this looks like be right back okay so we get a little bit of a clue when we complete a level i did on that first level so let's see what it says here real quickly so much to go through. So two out of two, I've made it to the next level and there are still 17 people. It really dropped from 99 people to 17 people there uh, when I beat that first level on to the next one. And I will show you the very end to see if that changes at all. Okay, so let's see if that changes for me at all. Got it on the first try. Click through all of these extraneous things. Of course, now it's not. Oh, wait, no, it did. <laughs> all right. But that doesn't mean that other people kind of won't be added into the mix, right? They still have a chance. All right, I should be back very soon with the results this time around for me. All right, so let's see what's going on with this so you know what to expect. And it should be five out of five. And let's see what else happens here. So there are eight of us in contention for this. And I think it might mean that eight of us have already made it up to the top. So I'm sharing the jock jackpot with eight other winners. And I get to, to claim my 12 right now. I don't have to wait those 24 hours. That's good to know. So 12 gold bars. I'll go ahead and claim that. And then I believe there's a cooldown of eight hours before we can play again. Now, is it worth 12 gold bars to spend a lot of boosters in order to accomplish this? That's something I'm going to leave to you to decide because, let's see, how much does it cost? Let's say I wanted some unlimited lives. It would cost me 69 gold bars to get six hours of unlimited lives. So we'd be using a lot. Let's do the most common, the striped trap. That's what I have the most of. It would cost me nine gold bars to get three. Well, guess what, folks? I used five of these in my attempt because I wanted to make sure that I got to the end real quickly so I could share this experience with you. So when I went in, I went in fully prepared with all of my entry boosters on all of these various levels. And so I spent more boosters than the value. But if you happen to be on a winning streak and you've got a lot of boosters already coming in and you're able to beat this without the help of boosters, 
on your first try, it may be worthwhile for you. Just make sure that you're not spending. And remember, I got 12. You might get six gold bars or, or two gold bars or one gold bar or 50 gold bars. So there's a, a gamble in here. There's risk involved. And so just make sure you are comfortable with whatever you invest. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. Uh, let me know if you've had this and how many gold bars you got. And as always, thank you all so much for watching. Bye-bye.